Hi and welcome to another NM Botronics tutorial. In this three-part series, I'm going to be teaching you about methods. Uh, you'll sometimes hear them referred to as functions, uh, subroutines, procedures. There's really no difference, just a different term for the same thing. Um, you know, why would we use a method? Well, let's say a robot is going to go forward, backward, left, right, stop. Uh, let's take stop for instance. Instead of programming in how to stop every time you want to stop, we're going to put this in its own little group, the code to stop, and then every time we want to use that, we will call it from a method. All right, let's get started here. We're going to first uh, declare an integer. Int x equals 10. Now we're going to get down here and set up the serial port. Serial, begin, and 9600. Okay, now down here in our loop, the only thing we're going to do is call a function, maybe have a delay for a few seconds, and then it's going to do it all over again. So let's type in uh, test method. And right there, this is going to call our method. And now we're going to go down and make a method. A test method. Uh, since it doesn't return a value, we're going to first start out void. Void test method. And we're going to give it two parentheses, open and close, open curly bracket, close curly bracket. Now, when we call test, when we go down through our code, we're going to come down to the loop, and it's going to loop this over and over. So we're going to call the test method. Whatever's in here is going to execute every time this is called. So what we're going to do is we're going to print to the serial monitor. We're going to go serial, uh, print, ln, and we're going to print the value of x. And then, so the next time, so it keeps changing, we're going to increment x by 1. And then when this method is all done, it's going to go back up here, and it's going to execute the next line. So we're going to give this a delay of 2 seconds. And here, our first method is made. We're calling a method. We're making the method do something. And now we're just going to test this out. Let's upload and see how it works. Oh, I forgot something. Oh, sorry about that. Compile, upload, and our code should go 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Let's see what it's doing here. 10, 11, 12, 13. So every time it does this loop, it's going to come down here, hit the test method. It's going to come down and it's going to print out the value. It's going to increase it by one and come back up here, delay two seconds. And then it's going to repeat the loop. It's going to print out, come down, do test method. It's going to print out the value of X, increase, keep on going and going and going. All right, so this was part one. Uh, look for part two when we uh, pass a variable to a method. And in part three, we're going to be returning a variable from a method. All right, thank you, and watch for the next part.